Hey guys, welcome back to my channel where I make some videos about tech, unboxing, product reviews, and events. And for today's vlog, I will be doing a study with me session studying Python. So if you're interested, please keep on watching and without further ado, let's get started with the video. So today is January 3rd, 2021. It is 1.30 p.m. and it's a Sunday so I decided to do some studying today, studying some Python today. And since it's 2021, I really wanted to achieve my goals for this year and one of them is to hopefully become an engineer someday and move out from the IT position. Since I have been in IT for about three years now, I really wanted to move out and do something else because I wanted more challenge and I really don't like the on-call anymore in IT and and dealing with the users that's really stressful so I really wanted to do some engineering and I am thinking about doing DevOps or systems engineering so I am currently studying Python to help me achieve that goal to be in that path uh, hopefully soon someday one day in becoming an engineer so today I will just show you my study session how I study what I am studying for everything in between that happens during my study session and at the end of the video I will also share with you what I learned from studying today so I am currently studying Python now because I think that is really a very in-demand skill at the moment, especially if you wanted to be in engineering. If you are coming from IT, it's also very helpful. So I'm taking this course in Udemy, which is really affordable. I got it for $9.99 and I really highly recommend this course that is called 2021 Complete Python Bootcamp from Zero to Hero in Python. This is constantly updated. See now the title is 2021. And this is really packed with all of the things that you needed to learn Python from beginning, from the very beginning until the more advanced topics. So I really highly recommend if you are just learning Python to check this out. It is on Udemy and also it is very interactive. So the, the lectures and the course itself is not boring. I really love how you learn a lot of hands-on on this stuff and they gave you, they give you a lot of like very uh, applicable exercises which is very useful for you to apply all of the knowledge that you just learned. So check this course out if you want to learn Python. So I have started this course already and I have finished the following topics, Python setup, Python object and data structure basics, Python comparison operators, Python statements, and now I'm currently studying methods and functions. So I'm just going to go through all of the courses here. I have learned the basics of Python functions, how to write a function. I also just finish doing some of the coding exercises for this and now I'm just gonna do more coding exercises so let's get started with studying so right now I'm just doing some exercises on different functions and uh, this is the problem define a function called my func that takes in an arbitrary number of arguments and returns a list containing only those arguments that are even so this should be the output of the the result of the code that i am doing i also um, tested this on the jupyter notebook so this is what i have and i'm just checking if my solution is correct but in here, like it looks like it's displaying it on the list for all the even numbers. So let's see. Okay, so the solution is correct for the problem. Yay! I need to keep practicing on the logic because I keep forgetting. But yeah, you just have to practice a lot so you won't forget. guys so it's almost five o'clock and now i am just taking a little break from the online course that i was doing i kind of felt overwhelmed and frustrated doing the exercises because i have just started studying again after a few weeks of 
taking a break from not studying at all so i'm just getting back into it getting back into coding again and sometimes that is tough especially if you are just learning because you have to like review again and then refresh your mind again because you keep forgetting if you don't do it a lot so now i just feel overwhelmed but during this break i am just gonna read my book to supplement what i've been studying online because sometimes book has more information and explanation than what is online so the book that i am reading is beginning python from novice to professional this book is i think old like two thousand from 2005 but i think the concept here is still valid because we still use the same in python anyway so i'm still reading this book and i like reading it because it gives you a lot of explanation so i'm just gonna read this book now i'm still in chapter one it's the basics i hope to finish it and after i finish it i'm gonna go back to do more exercises in the online course that i'm doing and methods exercises sums up everything that I have learned on the online course so far so it involves conditional statements string manipulation how to create functions and methods and all of that so it's really a good course and it really uh, refreshes my mind so that would be it for today's video of my study session studying python thank you so much for joining me on my journey i am hoping to really finish the course so i could study some more of what's needed to become an engineer someday and i hope to see you on my next study session and i will update you on the next topics that i will be studying for python and the things that i have learned so if you're studying python just like me um, let me know how is it going for you in the comment section below and maybe we can both uh, talk about our journey and I hope this video also inspires the other people who want to start uh, studying Python or just start learning a new skill. This is a new year so let's get our uh, goals done. Let's try to achieve what we have been aiming for this year and let's all claim it by working hard and just doing our best so i hope to see you on my next videos and thank you so much for watching